Club Jam. C-L-U-B space J-A-M. A gay bar in Salt Lake City, Utah. Presumably, homosexual men go there to meet. I don't know if homosexual women go there to meet. Have a drink or two. Dress like a Mormon. Attend Mormon themed parties in there where, hello, my name is missionary so-and-so, name tags. It seems the bar has what they call Mormon night. Great idea! Damn, I wish I could attend just for the the angst of it. Um, I would like be gay for uh, an hour or two or whatever the fuck it takes. Some of the the menu items for Mormon night are really cool. Sacrament shots, baptism by fireball, 151 missionary, I suppose that is the um, Anti-Equal Marriage Rights Act in Utah, I don't know. My favorite drink, Garment Dropper. I don't know what the hell that is, but I want one. I want two or three, whatever the fuck it takes, um, to drop garments. <clears throat> Oddly enough, and I don't understand this, church spokesperson Dale Jones says he is offended. I guess he's offended every time he goes in to the bar and attends Mormon night. Uh, he wants everybody to know that he's shocked, shocked, and offended that there is a Mormon night at a gay bar. You know, if somebody doesn't want to be offended by something, they should stop being offended by that something. Surely this is obvious. Nobody is offending them. They are being offended by themselves. If he would just ignore Mormon night, it wouldn't offend him. It wouldn't be offending anybody. It sounds like one hell of an awesome party, except for perhaps the lack of women. But, offended by Mormon night at a bar, I can only think, the only way a sane person could be offended by that is if they attended and they didn't have a good time. And how the fuck could you not have a good time when there's a drink called Garment Dropper?